Got a line. Good morning. Guys, today is our last day in Austin. Our last full day. Taylor is doing his breathing. This is like the first place <clears throat> that we've traveled that I've been like super sad to leave. I would probably stay here for another, another couple weeks or so. <laughs> but I'm, I'm excited to see what else we are doing. We are actually going to start heading up to Denver, Colorado to meet the Pangani tribe. They are other travel YouTubers. They have two kids. I'll put their link right up here or down in the description. But anyways, today. Today we're going to try Franklin's Barbecue. Apparently it's the best barbecue in the country. So we're going to see that. Um, they do sell out, so hopefully they won't sell out by the time we get there. So guys, welcome to our last day in Austin. Got a line. critic details. I enjoy the fattier brisket compared to the leaner. Really? Yeah, you can say here. Well, sausage? I think salt licks it's better. Yeah. But brisket's definitely yeah. top notch. It's so good. And the coleslaw is good? I would try it. Oh, you haven't tried it? Tastes like coleslaw. It's a little different. Really? That was amazing. That was great. And we met a really cool couple. We did. It was and, nice talking uh, to them. Yeah. But it was just nice, like, there's not a lot of seating and so there's a bunch of picnic people Ugh. so it's like you have to sit next to someone because there's all there's limited seats yeah that's what i just said so it makes you talk to people which is really nice and uh if you guys go there get the fattier brisket because the leaner is very good but the fat is just it's so much better yes it like melts in your mouth it's so tender mm -hmm. so good. it was delicious so good. the sausage was me it's like the outside's really tough i don't know if that's like authentic smoked sausage but i'm not used yeah. to the the it's casing the being chewy. so tough yep i have to go to autozone to buy a resistor so she'll. I don't know what I'm, what's a resistor. What Our heat or AC doesn't work on one or two. It works on three. Yeah. So, go to AutoZone to buy a resistor, which hopefully fixes that. It's like 20 bucks and it, you can replace it in like five minutes. What's a resistor? It's a part. And I'm gonna drop off the, my brake riders at AutoZone as well. Okay. Auto zone, here we go. So Taylor is 
in AutoZone getting that car part. First of all, we got a, a pecan pie at the at Franklin barbecue. I told him I want to eat it now. He was like, no, wait till we get home. But I want to eat it now. So I'm just going to sneak one little bite. It's so good. Mm. All right, we are back. Babe, you wanna try this pecan pie? No, it's still full. Did you eat it? No. Yeah, you did. <laughs> I ate it in the car when you were watching. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. He's like, I did not remember a big chunk from this thing. <laughs> Just watched The Walking Dead. And we if did. you haven't known us for very long, we love The Walking Dead. Today was a good day, but I think we're both just like exhausted. Yep. Had some great barbecue, Taylor claimed his bike. <laughs> We did some grease stuff to some <laughs> RV tires. I had no idea this was a thing, but this contraption that you're seeing is Taylor pumping grease into the wheel bearing. The wheel bearing. And tomorrow we are leaving for Waco, Texas for one night, and then Taylor is finding a place for us to live for a week. So guys, don't forget to give video a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet to see our journey thank you so much for oh, here. <laughs> thank you so much for joining our day today and we will see you tomorrow say goodnight daddy here he is he was rusty goodnight pups rusty don't quit that